so as you can see this is a yogurt container and this is my free greenhouse so I make a hole at the bottom of this and a hole on top of the lid and then I, after I put the plant I cover it like this and I'm going to show you how to make the hole so you keep the yogurt container and the lid both like this now something iron or steel or anything you heat it up really really good i'm going to show you that so as you can see i have this iron rod and i'm going to heat it up really good in the fire so when it's really really hot and then i will show you the next part but you need to be very very careful extremely careful doing this so as you can see my rod is smoking hot now I'm going to put it on top of that container and you see the lid and the container both now have a hole so this is how you're going to make a hole and you put little bit of water to cool it off to take it out so I'm going to run some water and this will cool off the rod and then I'll take it out and if you have more so you see the pot and the lid both has holes now and you're going to put your soil and then after that you're going to put your germinated seeds and then you cover it like this and this is your greenhouse and I'm going to make even farther better and I'll show you that one. so as you can see this is my friend free greenhouse for the cucumbers so you can put anything like this and this one you can cover it up and put it outside and as you see the yogurt containers I use and I put the cucumbers so the cucumbers growing nicely so this could make a beautiful greenhouse and it is all free so you see In order to be, make a free greenhouse, all you need is you need a empty cardboard box. You get it outside any grocery store. They have grocery store or any kind of stores. They have tons of cardboard box in their trash cans. So you get that. And then you have your yogurt containers. You save them as you everybody eats almost everybody's yogurt. So and then on that you germinate your seeds in ziploc bags and then you put it on the soil like i showed you and you have yourself a greenhouse you can keep it this one outside and when the sun comes you can open let them have sun and night time you cover them all and and to be safe you can even put a plastic cover on top of this so it'll be like perfectly safe so this is how you make a free greenhouse zero cost greenhouse and the plants are growing outrageously so now you see i put this seed yesterday and these are cucumber seed as you can see they germinated already in one day and they are germinating in paper towel i kept them in a corner of the kitchen so kitchen is warm and they germinated quickly and now look at these this is i transferred these seedlings to this cottage cheese slash yogurt container and look at this one day one day old seedlings so big it's like one inch tall look at them they are one to two inches tall and they are really awesome and now the trick to it is I kept it in this paper box you see this brown bag this box I get these boxes outside the grocery store so this paper boxes and I kept the lid on like this and this way they germinated and they grew faster so now uh, after two days I'll take the lid off 
and I'll put them outside so I'll wait for them to be three inches tall but I just like to share the idea with everybody so namaste my youtube family I am going to show you this napkin paper I have put the seed in the seed today I can see this is how big it is it is completely germinated और दो दिन में ये काफ़ी बड़ा हो जाएगा उसके बाद मिट्टी में मैंने इसको डाल दिया है और ये एक दिन का पौधा है एक दिन का पौधा इतना बड़ा हो गया है और वो इतना बड़ा इसलिए हुआ है कि ये जो योगर्ट और या तो फिर कॉटेज चीज़ का जो कंटेनर है उसमें मैंने एक छेदा नीचे किया है एक छेदा ऊपर किया है मेरे खीरे वाली दूसरे वीडियो में आप देखिए तो आपको मिलेगा कि कैसे इसके छेदे किए वैसे भी इस वीडियो के साथ मैं लगा दूँगी तो एक छेदा नीचे एक छेदा ऊपर किया है और ये जो है इसका कंटेनर का लिड मैं दे के रखी हूँ और इसमें थोड़ा सा पानी देती हूँ उसको लिड दे के रख देती हूँ ऐसे दो तीन दिन करने से पौधा बहुत ही बड़ा ये तो एक दिन का पौधा है बहुत ही बड़ा हो जा रहा है इसमें थोड़ा थोड़ा पानी दीजिएगा बहुत ज़्यादा पानी नहीं दीजिएगा बस स्प्रिंकल करना है हाथ से तो इससे बहुत जल्दी और इसको मैं किचन के कॉर्नर में रखी हूँ इसको बाहर में नहीं रखी हूँ ऐसे अमेरिका में बहुत ठंड होती है रात को तो फिर बाहर रखने से तो ये उगता ही नहीं है तो ऐसे मैं बस सबको बताना चाहती हूँ कि इससे पौधा बहुत जल्दी बड़ा हो जाता है बहुत जल्दी उग जाता है उसके बाद आप बाहर गार्डन में लगा सकते हैं और ये जो पेपर वाले बॉक्स होते हैं मूविंग बॉक्सेस इस बॉक्स के अंदर मैंने रखा है तो ऐसे करने से ये ग्रीन हाउस जिसको बोलते हैं जहाँ की पूरा कांच की ढक्कन होती है और पौधे को बड़ा करते हैं उस किस्म की इन्वायरमेंट हो जाती है लेकिन उससे भी पौधा अच्छी तरह से ब्रीद कर रहा है क्योंकि मैंने होल दिए चारों तरफ और ये पेपर वाले बॉक्स में तो अच्छी तरह से ब्रीद कर लेता तो इससे पौधा बहुत ही अच्छा उग रहा है तो मैं इसलिए शेयर करना चाहती हूँ आप सबके साथ कि देखिए ये कितने खीरे के पौधे आए मेरे एक भी सीड बेकार के नहीं गए हंड्रेड परसेंट सीड्स जो हैं वो ग्रो हो गए हैं तो चलिए मैं आपका आपको इसके अपडेट्स देती रहूँगी आप देखते रहिए और अपने फैमिली फ्रेंड के साथ शेयर कीजिए सबको बताइए होम गार्डन फैशन के लिए तो ये होम गार्डन फैशन है ही कि आप सबको सारी चीज़ों के बारे में सिखाना आइडिया देना जर्मिनेटेड दिस हॉट चिली पेपर सीड्स and then I am growing in a as you see I germinated them in a paper towel and I'm going to transplant them in my DIY free greenhouse now these are as you can see these are just little containers you get at the grocery store for certain things and this is for pitted dates I have and these are usually we just toss it in the garbage so instead of that I'm going to make them my greenhouse I made few holes at the bottom so as you can see there are holes at the bottom so you just make few holes at the bottom and you make a hole on the top so there will be some air circulating you have a hole at the top and in this one I put some soil and then I put my germinated this pepper seeds and I'll show you where I got so I want to show you how I got the chili pepper seeds. So as I, you see, I have this green peppers and I dry them until they become red. And these are the red chili peppers. So I keep them in a container like this, plastic container. And when I add them to my food, they become fully grown red chili peppers. So I just dry them and then I can store it. Now, if you want to grow plants from this, you can germinate them, the seeds in a paper towel, or you can just take this red chili pepper and take the soil. I have just regular soil and just cross it like this. So, this is how you can grow chili pepper from your home dried chili pepper. Be sure to wash your hand thoroughly after you do this because you crossed the chili pepper. You can wear a glove. And I'm going to show you. I'll also spread the germinated seed and then cover with with soil and water. So as you see, I have these germinated seeds in my paper towel, and I'm just going to pick them up gently. See, I'm picking up and placing in my soil. So I'm going to do that for all of these. And then I'm going to fill these 
container up with little bit more soil as you see they have developed seriously long roots so let me do this and then I will need to cover them with soil and put some water and keep them in a nice warm place in the kitchen or in a basement we keep it covered and if the nights are very cold outside don't keep it in outside because uh, chili pepper plants really need warm weather to grow so we'll keep it like this and then it will grow in six to ten days really big let me put all of them and then so as you can see i put all my germinated chili pepper in this and also i put the chili pepper seeds and I'm going to pour some more soil on top of it and cover and put some water and cover so I'm covering it a little bit lightly little bit of soil not too much so putting this little bit of soil So as you see I covered lightly and now I'm going to put a little bit of water just to keep it moist and not too much water and then I'll let it grow 10 more days and then I'll put it outside. So this was how to grow chili pepper seeds in your free greenhouse and first you start it in the paper towel the seedlings germinate them in paper towel and then you put it in these kind of empty containers you get something from your uh, store use them just be sure to make few poke few holes at the bottom one of my video the cucumber how to grow cucumber in the yogurt container cottage cheese container i have shown how to make holes in these containers so watch that and learn and then use it and this way you can grow a lot of vegetables in your garden but if you throw the seeds directly into the garden it will not work the the bugs and the birds will eat up the seed or seed will get frozen get very cold and they will not germinate so you need to keep the seeds in warm temperature also you need to let them sprout and get little bit big in warm temperature so thank you so much don't forget to like subscribe comment and share the video and i will see you with many 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 more videos also i'll keep updating about this getting big so jaise ki aapne dekha ki maine ye jo mirchai ke seed maine is tarah diplock bag mein seed dal ke grow kiya jaise ki ye hai dekhiye cucumber ke seed ye kaise usme germinate ho rahe hain usme ye grow kar rahe hain inside to aise karke maine grow kiya एक वन वीक रख के और जब वो थोड़ा थोड़ा ग्रो होने लग गए तो फिर उसमें मैंने उसको निकाल के ये जो कंटेनर है इसमें डाला ये सारे तो देखिए नीचे पौधा देख रहे हैं ये मिर्ची की पौधा है तो ये सारे कंटेनर्स तो हमारे फ्री आते हैं क्योंकि ये तो कोई भी चीज़ आता है ये जो है कंटेनर ये खजूर के कंटेनर थे इसमें खजूर था तो इन सब को तो हम थ्रो कर देते हैं ट्रैस में ये है फिर ये जो दही वाला कंटेनर ये कॉटेज चीज़ वाला कंटेनर आता है इनको सब को थ्रो कर देते हैं तो इसमें थोड़ा सा होल बना के हम पौधा उगा सकते हैं थोड़ा सा बड़ा जब पौधा हो जाएगा तब जाके बाहर हम मिट्टी में डाल सकते हैं इसमें पौधा उगाने का फ़ायदा ये है कि अगर ठंडे मौसम में पौधे को ज़्यादा ठंड लग जाती है तो ग्रो नहीं करता लेकिन अगर आप इंडिया में ग्रो कर रहे हैं तो आपको इसमें ग्रो करने की ज़रूरत नहीं है वैसे भी अगर आप इसमें सीड देंगे तो उसमें इंडिया में ग्रो करने से भी एक अच्छी चीज़ वो होगी कि इसमें सीड डालने से कीड़े और चूटियाँ जो है वो सीड को नहीं खा जाएंगे जो चिड़ियाँ होती है वो सीड को नहीं खा जाएंगे तो फिर आप इसमें सीड डाल के इसको थोड़ा सा बड़ा कीजिए फिर जब पौधा निकल जाएगा दो तीन इंच का तब जाके अपने गार्डन में लगाइए तो इससे आपकी बर्बादी नहीं होगी so thank you so much don't forget to like subscribe comment and share the video and i will see you with many 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 more videos